Hello my friend, happy to see you here and in this video we are going to solve this interesting brain test. We need to complete this numeric series. We have 8, 27, 64, 125 and we need to find the last number to this numeric series. Right here we have a lot of options A, B, C and D. So right now I suggest you to pause the video and try to solve it by yourself. It will be really interesting to check our answer here in just 30 seconds and we will check our answer. Of course it is interesting for me and of course for you to check our answer and to solve this correctly. Yeah? So we have this question 8, 27, 64, 125. I just read these numbers right here real quick. 8, 27, 64 and 125. So what is the pattern between all of these numbers? On the first side we can say like the, what is the pattern between all of these numbers. This is even, this is odd, this is even, this is odd number, this is on the first side. yeah. But if I look closely to these numbers, as for me, yeah, we have our 8. What about this 8? So right here I write this 8 as a product, because we all know that this 8 can be written yeah, as 2 times 4, yeah, we all know this. And this 27 as a product, how can we write it? Of course as 3 times 9, yeah. This one, what about this one? As 4 times 16, I guess, yeah, and 125 as 5 times 25, which is really great, we just not like simplify, I just or just write it in another way. What are we going to do next? Take a look closely. 4 and 9 and 16 and 25 we can write as a product as well, once more, yeah? So we have like 2 times 4 can be written as 2 times 2, which is really great. 27, 3 times this 9 as 3 times 3. 64 as 4 and right here times 4 times 4, because we write it the 16 as 4 times 4. This 9 as 3 times 3, this 4 as 2 times 2. What about 25? As 5 times 5, yeah? So 5 times 5 times 5. Okay, as you can see, this is really great because we have all the same numbers. So we have 2 times 2 times 2, 3 times. We have 3 to 3 times, we multiply it, we have 4 and we have 5. This looks like, this looks like our pattern, because if you know a little bit about algebra, this 2 times 2 times 2 can be written as 2 cube, yeah? This 3 times 3 times 3 can be written as 3 cube. This 4 can be written as 4 cube. 5 as 5 cube. And as you can see, we find our pattern because we have the same powers right here 3, we have 3, we have 3, and our last power, so to this, to this uh, last number, it will be 3. What about the number? We have 2, 3, 4, Five, so it looks like six right here. So our pattern will be the next one. Six cube. What about six cube? Six times six times six. It like thirty six times six, which is equal to two hundred sixteen. This is our answer to this. To this really interesting brain test. Our answer. Our answer. This is option C. Two hundred sixteen. So I hope you understand this explanation, I hope your answer is the same as mine, which is really great. This is only our cubes. 2 cubes, 3 cube, 4 cube, 5 cube. Thank you for your time, have a great day. If you want to support me, please leave a like below this video, I really appreciate it. Thank you for your time, have a great day, definitely don't feel bad if you got this wrong, ok? Now if you need to learn basic math, interesting brain tests, you need to enhance your logic right here, IQ, IQ level, you can easily subscribe to my channel, I really appreciate it. Thank you for your time and have a great day.